Now, the second point was so how many such columns we will make 11 or 10. 10, 10. 10 was there, the second is income, income level. So, second is income, income level, age, okay, sorry, it was age, age group. And what are the codes? 1, 4, 2, 4, 3. So, age group or age of the respondent, whatever you will write. So, define them code number 1, 2, 3. Sir, uh, we have written age, then age, then on this value click on these three buttons, then write 1 here and 20 to 30 and click on add, right sir. Like I have read 4, 4 means 50 to 60, click on add, then if you want to remove it just remove, add 1 then write second then third, write these three. Is it okay? Then click on okay. The third question was qualifications. And the qualification was 1 for UG. 1 for UG. Click on add. 2 for PG. And 3 is PhD. Have you taken 3 groups? Do it slowly, slowly. We are in no rush. Do at your own speed. Take your time. UG, PG, PhD. Just raise your hand in case of any doubt. Anything that is not clear, please ask. What was the fourth question? Now, in experience, there was no coding required. No, no. All the okay. Let me at this point let me explain what is meant by type, etcetera, and what is meant by the rest of the things. The codes we are giving as 1, 2, 3, it is numeral, right. So, what else can be there? In the language of computers, text is called as string. In the language of computer, text is called as string. So, if you wish to give the name of the person, then you should use it as string. If you wish to write name of the person, you also note down that. In that case, it will be called as string. If your like it is a time series data and one column is dates, then make it as date. If it is currency, then dollar, any scientific etcetera. So, almost always preferably in survey work, we define it as codes. Okay. Next it says width, width means the number of digits in the codes. We are entering 1, 2, 3, 4, the width is 1. If I will make the code as 101, 102, the width will be 3. So, by default the width is 8, it means 1 followed by 170. Uh, this much bigger code you can enter. So, so, what is meant by the code? If I want to put a unique number, for example, I put your PAN number, permanent account number. So, the width of my code will be 10 it will be 10 because it is 10 numbers required. If I will enter your Aadhaar number, Aadhaar card number 16, 
So, by default they had given as 8 1 followed by 7 0 this much bigger code I can generate. So, think of the code what exactly is the code where it is required. नहीं वैल्यू के लिए नहीं है ये कोड में कोड एक बार जस्ट टेल मी व्हाट इज द कोड कोड मींस द नंबर ऑफ कैटेगरीज इन द कैटेगोरिकल वेरिएबल दिस इज वी आर कॉलिंग कोड ना सो इफ आई विल से स्टेट नाउ स्टेट हाउ मच वेरियस ऑप्शंस आर पॉसिबल इन इंडिया 28 29 बट 29 व्हाट विल बी द विड्थ ऑफ कोड 2 अप टू 99 विड्थ ऑफ 2 विल बी रिक्वायर्ड it means I want to enter entire India 120 crore and every person will be given a unique number. In that case my code length will be maybe 16 Aadhaar card if you make like this. You got it? So, by default it is 8 you can increase it you can decrease it, but we are happy with it no problem. It is 8 and we are ok. Our codes will be maximum of 1 or 2 place. 11, 12, 13 or up to 99. This much you want to make a categorical variable containing 99 categories never, but SPSS can handle that it, it is comfortable even more than that, but we will never use it. A decimal it says write 1 as 1.00. If you do not want to write make it as 0 does not matter else 2 it is not saying anything. Now, what is meant by label? points 1.00 up to 3 decimal points 4. So, by default it says 2 you can remove you can increase decrease. The next one is label whatever you will write here will go to the output. You should be concerned here what to write here the space is allowed any length is allowed then you can copy paste from MS word. If your questionnaire is there you can copy and paste here that will work. Next is values values are the codes given code number 1, 2, 3 and the at attached meaning to it 1 means men, 2 means women like that. Next is the missing frequency. In case somebody does not answer do you want any number to be written there? So, that it is a identifier like if somebody do not reply write 99 there, but as of now we skip that. Columns 8 width of the column alignment is right alignment then measurement. SPSS talks about three sort of measurement. It says some there is something called nominal, there is a ordinal and scale. Interval and ratio it has merged into the scale which we call as metric. So, it is optional like you may define it first one is nominal, age group is ordinal, qualification is ordinal, experience is ordinal or I have taken actually the scale you may define it. There are just a few techniques which ask that please define it properly else it is free you can put all them scale and nothing will happen it is optional. In new versions there is something called role. If you got a new version of SPSS then you may find something called as the role. Role means whether it is a dependent variable independent variable. So, various roles we can define I will show you how it will ask that. I got one more version that is 18. In new versions of SPSS you may find something called role. Now, role it says input that is independent variable, target variable that is dependent variable, both that is mediator ok. It can be mediator then partition, partition may be a moderator or we operate certain things split that is again a sort of a moderator. So, it is complex, but again it is optional three things are compulsory name label value rest all are optional you can just skip that.